What makes hyperelectric flight so game-changing is that the face of flight will never look the same. This is a complete step change with where we're going and getting more electric and bringing electric from adjacent industries like the automotive industry into aviation. There's been a major milestone almost every single year since the team's inception. When I look back at 2015, we were able to do the power extraction test that included extracting one megawatt of power off an F110 engine. In 2016, we did the motor-driven prop. After the motor-driven prop test in 2016, we were able to quickly design, build, and test the second set of equipment in 2017. Concurrent to that rapid approach, we were also able to do a systems test right here at the epicenter, which showed a power transfer from one side to the other that improved our confidence going into 2018, 2019, and 2020, where we continued this rapid approach of design, build, and test and churn out as many components as we look to get more power dense with our equipment and more ready for flight testing. In 2022, we had a hallmark test the first and only of its kind at the NASA NEAT facility. This demonstrated a multi-kilovolt megawatt power class power transfer at altitude, something that has never been done before or since. All of the efforts that we've done on the component and system testing culminated in the win of the NASA EPFD Electrified Powertrain Flight Demonstrator contract. This is a great opportunity for GE to work with NASA as well as Boeing to take the components that we've been developing since 2016 into flight in the most robust tech maturation plan that the industry has ever seen. Boeing has procured the actual Saab 340 that we will be flying hybrid electric. By having NASA and Boeing on the EPFD contract, it adds instant credibility to what we're trying to do here. GE is the perfect place to be doing this. When I look at the expertise and the engineers, researchers, and scientists, as well as test cells that we have, there is no better place to make this happen. Just like hybrid and electric cars are changing the shape of the auto industry, GE, NASA, and Boeing are taking that same concept to the skies. We will make the skies more electric. And with that, we'll be able to move towards a more sustainable future.